Hello, welcome to this video for the L200 2.5 turbo diesel Barbarian 2012 registered uh, September in metallic black a very nice uh, looking pickup let's start on the bodywork let's start here this arch no damage whatsoever and this is obviously the arch that obviously gets the most uh, left hand turn gate post scratches should we say so there's nothing on there at all the paintwork is gleaming black alloy wheels are all in very good condition the last owners took very well care of this vehicle you can see all the arches are nice and clean uh, and obviously been treated as well uh, so of the rear brake drums there they've been painted as well to keep all the rust away uh, four matching Toyo tyres, the Toyo A28 open country tyres, all in good condition, all about five or six millimetres tread. That panel's nice and clean. They feel very, very light. Um, little lacquer scratches there. I think that's from um, sign writing. So it might have a sign writing on this before on that rear panel there but uh, it has got the odd very very light just about see it close up you can't see it from here at all like I say from close up you can see that it's much better you aware of that it's got these chrome uh, lights around as well it's got the uh, lower rear chin bar it's got the reverse camera as well this tailgate's in relatively good condition same again I think it's got a few little uh, marks from where the sign writing has been Oh yeah, it has. Well, so these guys did the sign writing before. VDK signs. Other than that, it's very tidy. And then in the back here, if I open this up, all the rear load is nice and clean as well. And it's not bad actually. It's not. It's not your typical builder's one where it's all scratched to death, etc. So that's really cool. That's really good. On here as well that's all nice and clean on that edge there this panel's better this panel's nicer there's no uh, scratches on this one which is very good and that arch immaculate as well a little bit of water runs there that's we'll just wipe that one and yeah that's just water runs there and condensation from being parked outside last night all the arches there absolutely immaculate you can see they've really put the under seal on there as well keep it all clean same on the rear drums as well alloy wheel very good condition has the side steps as well there's no stone chips on the rear uh, arches there at all all the paintwork up here is nice and tidy as well absolutely gleaming got the original stickers the barbarian stickers as well that door edge very very clean chrome mirrors or mirror cap should we say then we've got the uh, windscreen there let's have a look any chips no nothing major at all nothing major at all on there no cracks and no cracks uh, what do you call it no stone chips so very good that wheel arch there immaculate that wing there as well very clean no signs of any rust creeping through on the rubber seal there that alloy wheel Immaculate. So the Toyo tyre matching, and they're all about six or seven millimeters the tyres. Headlights ultra clear, so no yellowing of the headlight plastics there. Very clean. Uh, the bonnet's very clean as well. Maybe the odd few uh, stone chip that's been touched up over the years. It's there like that. It's very very few. Nothing major at all, so very good. All the chrome work's nice. There's no cracking on the chrome work at all. Even the number plates around and the bottom, that's all nice and clean. No flaking or cracking. That headlight, crystal clear. Obviously Xenon lights as well there. It's got the lower fog lights, the lower sports fog lights, these. This corner, very tidy. No signs of any damage at all or scratches. That wing very clean, that alloy wheel, that tyre and all the inside of there is nice and clean and been treated. 
got the mud guards as well. Got the four mud guards, all nice and clean. Uh, looks like original Mitsubishi windscreen that one as well with the logo. So that's original. So that's all very clean. And then this uh, chrome mirror cap that's clean. No scratches on the edges there. The roof is clean. That door there, very clean. No dents or scratches on both these doors. In fact, all four doors are totally unmarked. That's the uh, side step there. And the chrome pipe here, that's nice as well. So that's all the car covered on the outside. That's the outside covered. We've seen the inside there. Let's start in the back. This side, this side's where obviously most occupants get in and out and that's very clean that. There's no trap seat belt marks on the door shuts there. There's no worn rubbers, etc. The seats are in good condition. Got these fitted car mats as well, the drinks holder there. Do the front passenger's door. That's all nice and clean. these chrome uh, <coughs> barbarian kick plates as well and that little pattern there is actually the bottle the one that matches up with that out there so that is the original decals should we say that is the original decal on the outside let's go to this back door that's all nice and clean all the door shuts are clean the rear's got chrome, uh, sorry, not chrome, stainless steel kick plates as well. All the door cards are nice and clean as well. There's the driver's door. Even the lights are working as well. Four electric windows, a child lock there. All oh, that's nice and clean. The speaker grills in good condition. All the door shuts are nice and clean. The pedals are clean. The car mat and that stainless steel kick plate once again. Uh, folding mirrors as well, so if we press that button there, we'll get the folding mirror, and then press that again to unfold. And that's traction control there as well, electric mirrors. Two keys, two remote central locking keys, they both work as well. Uh, that here is an old touch key immobiliser, which is not in use at the moment, so that's uh, obsolete. This driver's seat is in good condition for the mileage, 115,000 miles, that's a good condition seat that. It's not split at all, a little bit of wear on it, but nothing major at all. Kenwood head unit, standard. Uh, obviously this is the, uh, is it USB this one? No, it's the AUX. It is AUX there, and it's also got the uh, Bluetooth, little Bluetooth uh, logo there. Uh, climate control, etc. And then uh, we've, got, oh, we've got the reverse camera as well, look, put it into reverse, that's the reverse camera as well. So the reverse camera is in, in, integrated, that's the word, integrated. Uh, this has also got, if you put the menu, I'm sure it's got, yeah, it's got a sat-nav set up. So obviously you can, I think you can transfer your details off your phone to that. Let's have a look, see if it works. Yep, do you want to agree? Yep, yep, do agree again. View map. So it has got a map, but whether it's up to date or not is another question. So it has got a map, but it might not be up to date. Uh, what's down here, cubby hole, and then you've got your electric rear window, this one here, so if I press that, the rear window will go down and up, so it's got electric rear window, that's novel, novel for the kids or the dogs uh, in the bike, it's a five speed gear lever there, I think you just make it out there, five speed, this is the uh, two wheel and obviously the four wheel drive selector there, obviously at the moment it's on normal rear wheel drive, two wheel drive mode, which is what you're supposed to drive it in, to save fuel obviously uh, we've got a little coin tray down there all works a uh, little um what you call it now that's supposed to be an ashtray that never been used uh and then a little cubby hole there as well uh and then on here you've got the steering wheel controls which are the volume and track and then the cruise control there uh normal lights this one the mileage today, 115,054. Uh, what else have we got here? 
Well, that's about it inside. Oh, little sunglasses holder up here. Yep, sunglasses holder. The uh, roof lining is very clean as well. Uh, so, yeah, the roof lining is very clean. Uh, and then you've got this lockable glove box as well. Uh, and you've got all the documents in here. So this has got really good service history. It's waiting for the service as we speak. Uh, booked in on Wednesday the 22nd of March at uh, Mitsubishi Service Centre, the Mitsubishi dealer in Sheffield. So that's the MOT certificate there last year with no advisories. It runs out in April. So we're going to get this done on the... Oh, wait a minute. Expires then. Yes, on the 5th of April we will put a new MOT on it, so it'll have 13 months MOT. So all the book packs here, the service booklet, uh, which has got about seven, seven or eight services, this one, in total. Let's just have a look, there we go. So, it's got the maintenance record, as you can see there, you've got all these Mitsubishi dealer stamps. Uh, service four was by an independent, uh, and then one was by this garage here in Balls Over. In Chesterfield so we're gonna that was 109,000 miles so 6,000 miles ago it was serviced uh, it's lack of use for sale by the uh, by the current owner who is VAT registered by the way so this is we bought it VAT registered uh, some invoices here as well for servicing in 2008 uh, and other invoices etc so it's got invoices which is good two keys HPI clear uh, let me switch the engine off so we can look under the bonnet without... So that's the bonnet there. So if we pull that up under the bonnet and we're done. Oh, so that's that. The bonnet stay... Here we go. So it's the 2.5 common rail four-cylinder DID engine. It's a turbocharged engine. That's the turbocharger there. So the air box there. The battery, which is obviously the proper size battery that fits as well. Everything's nice and clean. HPI clear, like I said, never been involved in an insurance claim or accident uh, involving insurance right off. So it is HPI clear. All this is nice and clean up here as well. Uh, and that's pretty much it. So let's just drop the bonnet again. Just walk around it. If you've got a part exchange, please let us know the mileage and the current range number so we can give you a valuation. Uh, we can have finance on this vehicle possibly up to three years with the age. So probably three years finance on this. Okay. So, any more questions, please do not hesitate to drop us a line. And uh, hope to see you soon and hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you.